Okay, everybody, moving on in my collection purge today. I'm not even going to do just F because considering we have Ferrari and Ford, I'm going to split those up with any other Fs like Fiat. But this is going to be depressing because it is Ferrari. We're going to see all these awesome castings. That'll be the fun part. The sad part will be how many Ferraris we haven't seen in, what, three or four years now from Hot Wheels. So let's work through the collection. But we are going to start with the Ferrari GTO. My Ferrari collection is, my Hot Wheels Ferrari collection at least, is pitiful. I'm happy with it. I have the castings I want. There's a whole lot of ugly Ferraris that I don't like. Those are all three of the first editions. I don't have every one of these. This is the um, Ferrari 250 LM. Um, this is the Speed, or not Speed Machines, Ferrari Racers. Isn't that pretty? Those co-mold wheels. I did that Speed Machines feature. You'll see a few of these pop up here. Another one of those. That is the 250. Then here we go. Another classic Ferrari. This is one I would love to see back. Ferrari, it's trying to get like 250 GTO. Just one of those just unbelievably gorgeous models and a gorgeous casting as well. So there's actually two, this is a variation of the first edition. This one had the black intakes. This one does not. This is the more common one. I think they realized they couldn't do the um, intakes or not. I don't know, recolor in black. This is about 2009, I think, about the time they released the Datsun 510 yellow. Continuing with the 250 GTO, how about the Garage Release Premium? Real Riders Metal Base. This is one of the prettiest models there is. Two colors of that one. I don't know which one's better. This one might be. It's kind of grayish, bluish one. Oh, to see that model again. All right, and the last one was a five-pack model with the racing roundel on it. I don't need to make any space for any future Ferraris, at least at this point, so we just move right on. This is my only Dino, Dino, from Entertainment. A one and done from Ferris Bueller's. How pretty is that? Oh, my goodness. I hate going through these because, well, I love going through them, but it's just so depressing. And uh, I'm just going through these, so I can't remember... Exact name. Hard top, the exact name. Sorry, I'm mumbling. Hard top, and there's the convertible from Ferrari Racers. This was a Valentine's release. Crazy, right? And then Miami Vice from Entertainment. All right, 288 GTO. Love the nose on this one. Wish it didn't, well, I wish it didn't have the Big rear wheels, but I'm not going to complain too much about it. Mainline release had three colors. I don't have all of these. Look at that burnt orange, brown, whatever color that one is. That one's just awesome. Kind of a cool, surprising recolor. Garage. I have three colors on that one. Red, black. This kind of predates car culture and boulevard and yellow. There's a gray, like it was a multi-pack version. Don't have that one. Here's a Ferrari Racers version. Wish I had the wider rear wheels, but oh well. Favorite one? Crazy. Five-pack version in white. Just so nice. Those PR5 wheels. 388, right? 308, sorry. That is uh, Racers, Ferrari Racers. Ferrari Racers, great color combination there. Mainline release, mainline release, recolor. Okay, continue with the 308. One of these is a garage release, and one of these is entertainment from Magnum PI, and I can't remember which is which. They both have the same wheels, so um, I'll just put them right there. Okay, more modern Ferraris. This is the um, 380 Modena. Right. There was a five spoke and a PR5. I only wanted the PR5, thought it looked better. Ferrari Racers. That's the only two I have of that one. Then this is one of the great ones. 430 Scuderia. Scuderia, right? I always pronounce things in Portuguese with that emphasis on the second to last syllable. 
Those are both Ferrari racers, and that's where I screw up sometimes in my pronunciations. Mainline release in yellow, recolored in red. I actually think this was a Kmart, or I'm sorry, a Walmart release. The red one. Five pack release. There we go. Treasure Hunt. They didn't have the Treasure Hunt symbol back at these days, but that was the Treasure Hunt. Five pack. 612 Scaglietti from the Ferrari Racers and then Speed Machines. We just featured that one. Then a run of Ferrari five pack versions. This is a great casting. Kind of a strange Ferrari. Some people really didn't like it, but I love this casting of it. Really, really nice. Enzo. Don't have too many Enzos, but I think I have some nice ones. Ferrari Racers. Ferrari Racers, showed that one just recently. I like to be careful with the paint on that one. This is from a truck, one of those transporter type um, releases, and I like that one in black. I could probably use some. If I run into some more Enzos, I'll probably buy them, but not if they're too expensive. That's a Ferrari Racer, and then, oh, California. I think that was a five pack in yellow, and then I have one Speed Machines. There's one other I need. More California. This is the faster than ever. And then on to the 599 GTB Ferrari Racers. Ferrari Racers. For, no, that was, yeah, Ferrari Racers. This is Speed Machines. Speed Machines. There are some mainline versions of that one. I just, I think I purged them a while ago. So they're somewhere. All right, we showed you this one. This is the, there we go. Let's get it some better light. 599XX. I've probably done overkill on this model, so you've seen enough. Here's the black version. I actually have two of those. Typically, I don't put duplicates in here, but considering the rarity that these are, I have two of these two. One of the Zamac and another... More 599XX, there's the mainline release with MC5. Check, a, check out the wheels, MC5, and then OH5. These are actually see-through, hard to tell. There, the MC5 are not see-through, so that's a variation. Super Treasure Hunt. And then the final Ferrari released before the license went away. Super Treasure Hunt as well. So two Super Treasure Hunts on the 599XX. Alright. 458, right? Italia. First release in red. Then yellow. Then faster than ever. Faster than ever recolor. This one. I just love it. Italian colors on it. Recolor, which is okay, but not nearly as good as the white one. You know what? I'm going to do something. Purge. I don't want it. Gone. Now, I'm going to purge one other one too. Not this one. This is from that. Very interesting. We haven't seen these wheels again. This Ferrari Racing, or no, Hot Wheels Racing series. And um, I saw it at Target and a few other stores. This one was super difficult to come across, but look how cool it is. Um, anyway, I'll feature that another time. But I'm going to purge the mainline version. I don't like it. This casting's not great in the front, kind of awkward. So it has to be really good looking, considering I already have that one. Purging that one. So two Ferraris purged, didn't expect it. Just a few more Ferraris. There's another 458, but this time it's the Roadster, or Spider, right? Yep. Same thing as like the hardtop. It was red, then yellow, then here's the next release. In black, this is a variation, black interior. That's a holdover from the year previous. I'm supposed to have this color interior, so I have two variations on that one. Beautiful blue version. This is my favorite one of that Roadster. And then five pack version, which I like. Ferrari FF, 
in red. Now this one has the emblem on the front grill. And then no emblem. So I have those two variations. Then metal flake, silver or gray. Then more of a dull silver or gray. I'm not going to try and put those together right now, but they do look different. Ferrari FF from the five pack. I love the FF. All right, 612 Berlinetta, right? F12 Berlinetta in red. Zamac, that's a great one. Silver. Yellow. And the final new casting from Ferrari was the uh, La Ferrari. Not a great casting, but I'm keeping it. Red. And kind of this metal flake silver. I feel like I have a nice little Ferrari collection. There's more that I would love to have, but I'm not going to worry too much about them. I just want them to come back. Don't you guys? All right. That's the purge for this one. We got more to come. I got a lot of work to do. Bye.